Look at that horsey. You see that? One day you guys will be big enough to ride this bad boy. So it's like 7.30 in the morning right now. Jenny's still laying in bed, but uh, I'm gonna try to surprise her for her birthday. Okay, I'm not really gonna try to surprise her. I'm gonna try to scare the shit out of her. I've got some rose petals here. I'm gonna fill a balloon with them and go pop them over her face. She's gonna love it. I'm gonna try to get as many of these into this balloon as I can. We'll see how that works. I'm not really sure how this is gonna work, but I'm gonna make it happen. Right, I've got a ton of these stuffed inside this little pink balloon. It kinda looks a little sketchy. I'm trying to smuggle drugs or something. What is drugs? Success. She's gonna love it. Don't have a birthday cake for Ginny because she's not too big of a sweets person. But last night I made chocolate covered strawberries for her. These are like the tiniest little balloons. I'm scared to blow them up more. They're gonna blow my face off. I figured I'd better make her some of her favorite tea if I'm about to scare her face off. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! <laughs> that was cool. Is it like a, a flower balloon? <laughs> it was a flower filled with, or it was a balloon filled with uh, petals. Oh, it smells so good. <laughs> I scare the shit out of you? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you should just do some flower petals. <laughs> <laughs> Breakfast, my dear. <laughs> not breakfast. You gotta eat one. <laughs> no, not for breakfast. I'm gonna eat like 10 of them, so you have to eat at least one. Just wait until my organs wake up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm still gonna eat 10 of them. Boys, did you find your mommy's birthday sign? Yeah, you did. Don't destroy it. You guys made it all by yourselves, didn't you? Say happy birthday, mommy. Happy birthday to the best mommy ever. Hey, sisters. We're daddy hugs. It's not for babies. You can't have these. You're like, oh man. Those look good. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Say that again. What'd you just say? You said dad dad. What was that? He just whispered it. You whispering, Dada? Hey, you're Package from Aunt and Uncle. What's your favorite wrapping? Baxter and Sire. Ah, <gasps> you. Happy Valentine's Day. You did get something after all. Isn't that sweet? Can't be beat. 
you start your first little Valentine. Aww. Little Hot Wheel Valentine. <laughs> Hot Wheel. Oh my gosh, you got some big boy Valentine cards. Uh -huh, we got some Hot Wheels. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh nice. You are, I'll be there. Looks like your style. Mm -hmm. It's Peaceful Warrior brand. You guys got some new toys? We like balloons, huh? How about that? Boys just don't want your mommy to leave, do ya? Jeannie has to work tonight. On her birthday. Valentine's Day though, so. Might be busy for her. We're just gonna have a little boys day, aren't we? Yeah? Little baby daddy day? Alright, I love you. Have a good night. If you've never worked in a restaurant on Valentine's Day, you're not missing anything. It's not fun. People who work in restaurants call it amateur night. People always make reservations at the last minute. Nobody really has a good time. If you really wanna treat your guy or gal to a good time on Valentine's Day, stay home, cook some dinner, enjoy each other. I don't work on Tuesdays, so I managed to not have to work on Valentine's Day. I'm cool with that. Boys and I are gonna hang out. I just got through cleaning the house really well. They're about to wake up from their nap. I'm gonna feed them, and I think we're gonna go to the bookstore, grocery store, and uh, do some other stuff. We'll see what happens. Said I'm ready to go, Dad. Got the twinsies out of the house. Our first stop is Barnes & Noble. We're gonna look at some books and uh, maybe get some coffee. Check it out a little bit. It's one of my favorite places to go. It's always nice and relaxing. Chills me out a little bit. The boys love it too, don't you? You guys want to read a book? You want to read a book and we'll show it to mommy? You do. Llama Llama Red Pajama reads a story with his mama. Look at the fishy book. Yeah. Oh, you like that, don't you? Yeah, you do. You already got your book picked out, huh? Fishy, 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 fishy. We had to leave Barnes & Noble because these little guys were getting fussy. We were just crying our little lungs out, weren't we? Got a few more spots to go. Gotta go to the pet store, get some wood chips for Beatrice, and then a few things at the grocery store, and I think we'll be done for the night, so. Probably gonna end this vlog here. Thanks for checking it out, and until next time, peace.